hypoglossal nerve is the 12th cranial nerve located below the tongue. That's why it is called hypoglossal. The nerve fiber component of it includes general somatic efferents. It supplies all intrinsic and most of extrinsic muscles of the tongue. Hypoglossal nucleus is located close to midline in the lower part of the fourth ventricle in medulla oblongata. It receives ipsilateral and contralateral innervation from cerebral cortex. But those fibers which are going to genoglossus receives predominantly contralateral innervation. The nerve fibers of hypoglossal nerve will traverse through the substance of the medulla oblongata to exit between pyramid and olive. Hypoglossal nerve exit cranial fossa in hypoglossal canal. It lies between internal jugular vein and internal carotid artery. It runs all the way down up to posterior belly of digastric. Accompanied by it along the tendon, it runs forwards crosses internal carotid artery and external carotid artery comes to lie beneath the mylohyoid muscle. From there it supplies the tongue by various branches and responsible for all the movements and shape of the tongue. It is closely related to the C1 fibers which forms the answer of a callus. Hypoglossal nerve can be clinically tested by asking the patient to protrude the tongue and noting whether it is deviated to any side. If it is deviated to one side, then the nerve to that side is damaged. The tongue is pushed to paralyzed side by muscles of the functioning side. It can also be asked to push the tongue into the cheek and then palpate the cheek to feel the tone and strength of tongue muscles. Lesions of hypoglossal nerve can result in ipsilateral lower motor neuron problems of the tongue and can push the tongue to the opposite side. Thanks for listening. We shall see you in the classroom.